Hello, it's Krista here again today. And today I want to talk a little bit um, about uh, taking cautionary measures um, when exposing yourself to uh, sunlight or tanning beds um, because of skin cancer. Um, today I just found out that uh, a friend of mine that I used to work with passed away of uh, um, she had uh, been diagnosed with uh, skin cancer uh, just this past year and um, also a tumor formed in her head and um, she had it terminally and ha uh, just now recently passed away um, so um, today I just kind of wanted to uh, maybe help talk to people about the awareness of um, uh, having a more um, extreme exposure to sun and ultraviolet rays. Um, this can be dangerous if you do it uh, for too long. I know that uh, the friend of mine that this happened to uh, used to love the uh, being out in the sunshine and using tanning beds. Um, and she would use them daily, um, you know, for uh, usually longer periods. And, um, um, I mean, she would use them so much that she, her skin was almost like black. I mean, it was just, you know, she had to have that awesome, awesome dark tan. And, um... You know, her, her skin would almost be like sandpapery in some parts of her body. And so, um, you know, that's, that's just too much. And um, it's just not good for a person. And I know that even myself, I, was, I always tried to be more careful and just kind of use them now and then. Um, you know, especially the tanning beds during the winter times. Um... But, um, and then of course I love the sun too. So, you know, you get me on the beach for at least an hour or so at a time, just getting a tan. Uh, but still, but as I'm just turned uh, 41 last year, I did start noticing these last couple of years that I myself had started getting uh, sunspots, which you probably can't see and I'm not doing a close up because my face is just full of disgusting pores. <laughs> But yes, I do have, um, you can see it right there where sunspots are and they're actually like brown and freckly like, and, um, you can't really see it on this side, but there are kind of some right there. And those are actually, uh, the first beginning stages of skin cancer. Not that you have to be scared if you might have some, you know, sun spots here and there on your face or your body. Um, because it's not going to hurt you, but they are signs just kind of like saying, hello, you know, you better quit um, exposing yourself to too much sun and stuff because it's going to get worse and it, it can eventually get so bad that it can turn into skin cancer. So, um, my friend was only the same age as I am, 40, 41, um, and um, I just want to say, rest in peace, Michelle. Uh, you're a beautiful, fun-loving lady and everybody loved you. And um, may you, uh, may this help uh, some people out there too. So, God's peace.